Y'all already howdy doodly do do do. I'm gonna show y'all how to do the Reaper thing real quick. So first of all, we're gonna download we're gonna download this Reaper. There's a stat that I put in the description. Y'all just gonna go click on that. We're gonna click download. Of course it's gonna take a while, but it's buy the internet slow like a bitch, but then you're gonna click on 64 bit. I always click on 64 bit. If you have a slower computer, then maybe go with 32. We're gonna go with 64. Again, my computer going slow as shit, but it's all good. That number, that means nothing to me. It's just gonna keep on going, going, going. This video is to help you guys on how to download Reaper and to use Reaper a little bit, just so it helps y'all. So, anyways, let's let's just let's just open that when it's done. And then we wait. There we go. You click agree. There you go. You you click install. Yeah, actually. Oh yes, we want to we want to open that. All right. So this is what Reaper looks like for y'all. Now this thing's gonna show up. Just just don't. It says Reaper's not. Don't pay attention to that. Don't pay attention to that. It's fake. It don't work. Anyways, you're gonna right click and you're gonna insert a new track. And then I'm gonna insert another track because one's gonna have our music and the other one's gonna be our vocals. So now I'm gonna I'm gonna just gonna go to my files. I'm gonna just bring this over to the side because I got some files I don't want you all to see. It's it's got secrets and I like to keep my secrets. So I'm gonna just go to my downloads real quick. Um, I got something. Uh, here this is a beat I guess. All right, there we go. Now, we want to select on this, and we're going to turn on this little record, this this little red dot up here. You're going to click, click it. it. Now, now, I know, I know it's, it's an echo. echo. You want to double go. click that, and it turns it off, just like that. See? After that, you just have to go down here, click record. It's going to start doing that. And then after that, you just, you just sing whatever, like... I don't know what I'll be singing at all. I don't know what to say, but I know I'm just gonna go with the flow anyway. I don't even know what to sing about at all. After all, this is just a demo. Oh, 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 oh. After that, I just middle click. And you see, that, that thing's gonna pull up right there. I'm just gonna click X. Anyways. I'm going to show you all a little bit extra to this. Because I just want to keep this, but I don't want to keep all the parts of the me talking. So what you do is, you're going to click there. You're going to right click. And you're going to go split item at cursor. After that, what you can do is you can hold uh, shift. Right? Now obviously i got to delete this first. There we go. But if you click shift, that's so you get the exact par. And you can start moving this around too. It really does help. Now I kind of fucked myself. But also clicking it and holding shift can help you do that. Move it a little bit you know. And you know what all you got to do is after that. You just go to file. Render. You, you did bleed the god you cannot. And then you just put in whatever time. You would have to go to custom. Uh, time. Or entire project. Just do whatever. Uh, this will let you be able to pick how much you want to show that's if you just want to show somebody just a little bit of your project you know what i mean after that you just render file and then it's done well that's it that's all y'all need to know uh, i hope that helps y'all a bit uh, i hope y'all are able to understand me i love y'all so mwah. i gotta get back to my puppy dog get my puppy dog back there and i hope uh this helped y'all a little bit Eat.